standing here in New York City, Manhattan, while the Salute to Israel parade is going there. And this is so sad. We see people, Jewish people celebrating the state of Israel. What are they celebrating? They are celebrating the greatest rebellion against God. The state of Israel is an official rebellion against God and against Judaism, the Jewish religion. All what the state of Israel stands for is contrary to Judaism. The concept of building a sovereign homeland for Jews is in total contrast to the basics of Jewish belief. We are in exile. We are forbidden to create a state of our own. How dare these people to stand up and to speak in my name, to speak in the name of the Jewish religion. And in addition to all of this, all of this will be forbidden, all of this will be wrong, all of this will be contrary to Judaism, even if it doesn't affect anyone, if, even if it doesn't commit any crimes against other people. When this happens in Palestine, by killing people, stealing the land, oppressing an entire people, this goes on, this is not a story from once upon a time, in 1948, 1967, or whatever war you're going to, you name it. This is going on to the present day. And, in addition to all of this, it's being done in my name. It's being done in our name. They insist to call their state the state of Israel. They insist to call it the Jewish state. And they have all Jewish people accountable to all what they are doing. And, sadly, they are misusing the Jewish religion. To God forbid, condone all these violence, all these crimes, and all this bloodshed. We stand there and we say no. We as Jewish people, we as religious Jewish people, representing many Jewish communities worldwide, who are opposed to the existence of the State of Israel, who condemn all actions taken by the State of Israel against Palestinians, against anti-Zionist Jews, against anyone who stands in their way. This is a criminal state. This is an anti-Jewish state. In no way does it represent world Jewry, and certainly not the Jewish religion. This is a desecration. This is an embarrassment. This has to stop today. How sad is it when we see these young boys and girls, these young kids marching in this parade. Why? Because they are educated in this single-minded Zionist propaganda who teaches them as if the Jewish religion, to be honest to God, is to support Israel. And to follow the Jewish religion, you have to support Israel. How ridiculous is this? Uh, unfortunately, sadly, what is the what comes out from this education? You not necessarily need to practice Judaism. You not necessarily need even to believe in God. If you want to be a good Jew, you have to support this nationalism, this national movement of Zionism. If you want to be a Jew, you have to support what? You have to support all these crimes, all these bloodshed that ends up at the end of the day to be even dangerous for the Jewish people. The state of Israel is not even the security for the Jewish people. They shouldn't even use this as an excuse, even if it, if it will be, if it would have been a security for the Jewish people. If these are crimes, if this is a violation of Judaism, this should never take place. But it happens to be that this is dangerous for the Jewish people in addition to all crimes being done, all catastrophe being inflicted to the Palestinian people. This is dangerous to all involved. This is a Nakba, a catastrophe. This is a tragedy for humanity and everyone included. May God help. People should wake up one day, tomorrow morning or today, and realize that all of this is wrong. Realize that if we want to be serious human beings, we should never support Israel. If we want to be honest to God, we should never support Israel. If we want to be in favor of Jewish people, we should stand up and condemn all what's being done in the name of the Jewish people. And we are standing here in, our, in expressing our solidarity with Palestine. Because, because all what was done to Palestine is criminal, it's anti-Jewish, and it's in, against the will of masses of Jewish people worldwide. All what was done in, in the beginning, the, the, the beginning of the occupation, the continuation of the occupation, and the, 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 especially this right-wing Zionist government now, which is going even way worse than it was until now. It was worse enough, it was bad enough till now, but unfortunately it's, 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 it's becoming worse and sadly becoming supposedly this more religious face, which is a whole hypocrisy and a whole 
uh, uh, confusion may people realize and understand. According to Judaism, all of this is wrong, and Jewish people, the world over, oppose everything. May God help with His mercy that all these catastrophes, all this calamity should stop. We hope that, that this occupation in its entirety, the existence of the State of Israel in, in its entirety, should stop soon in our days. May God help that this should stop peaceful, with no more suffering of anyone involved. And at that time, we can hope and we pray to God that once this obstacle to peace will stop, this movement of Zionism, this occupation of Palestine, which caused the conflict in the very beginning. We lived in peace. Our historic peace was destroyed because of this occupation. And sadly, the continuation of this occupation is the prevention that we should not, is the obstacle that we should not have peace. We hope that once this obstacle to peace, this occupation of Palestine, the existence of the State of Israel will stop in its entirety, hopefully peaceful, we will be able to see once again this beautiful peace that did take place once upon a time. We hope that this will be again in the near future. God willing. Thank you very much. Associate me with any party. This is a general flag. 